My name is Diane Hurd, and I am a co-founder of Speak On It, Act On It. I am Clyde Johnson, the Executive Director for Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion here at Carroll Community College. I'm Jim Ball. I am the president of Carroll Community College. I am excited about how it's going so far. We have so many vendors out here, and everybody's getting along very well. We have our live group going on right now. This is exciting. It was a whole group of volunteers that thought about this in 2021, just thinking about how could we create an event around African-American identity, and we thought about Juneteenth. The first event was held at the Carroll Arts Center uh, last year for Juneteenth, and we recognized we needed a bigger space uh, to spread out. We wanted to invite more people. It was successful last year as an inaugural year, but we know we needed a larger place to do it. We've got a an amphitheater here. We've got really direct and close parked. And, and we've got a, a lot of area for vendors. Weather has cooperated really well, so we're, we're really, really pleased that it's going so well today. My favorite part of, of this year's festival is the inaugural James Baldwin Award. We decided we wanted to recognize someone who's been working out in the field around diversity, equity, and inclusion over the years. We decided that the first recipient is the one and only Mrs. Virginia Harrison. As you know, Mrs. Harrison has been working in this area for many years. She's one of the co-founders of Carroll Citizens for Racial Equity, which is in its 31st year, but she's also served on our school board, and which is a great opportunity to recognize her for the many years of contributions to Carroll County. Juneteenth is special to me because again, it's the it celebrates the emancipation of the Africans. We always say African Americans, but we weren't African Americans, we were Africans. So it just represents the, the, the freedom of our ancestors, and this is the blood, the sweat, the tears, this country, that everything that we put into making this country what it is today. It's wonderful to be to recognize a holiday that recognizes us.